Talk with your head down. Do you want to sit up here with mommy? Yes or no? I can't see you. Yes or no? You got to sit. You got to use your words, baby. You got to use your words. I'm sorry. You got to use your words, baby. You want to sit up here? Yes or no? Okay. So you have to say what you have, baby. No need to cry. <clears throat> Where did it come from? Girl, you fake ass. Where did it come from? Where did it come from? Girl, you fake. Where the hell you Where come from? Come This is the stage two Faha. As you see, it's much tighter. It took me a little minute to get in this one, but I'm fine. Are sure you ready? Come on. Come on, Trey. Trey. You know what? I'm going to open your ass. I got an idea. Yes. Stop it. 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 Stop heartbreak is how long you're gonna be heartbroken that's the question the question is how long are you going to be heartbroken and also when you get heartbroken the person that broke your heart can he keep your heart or did you take your motherfucking heart back that's the real question the real question is when that nigga broke your heart did you let him keep it or did you take that bitch back and you ready to get that bitch to somebody else that's the question. That's the real question. Oh, that's the real question. Don't let them, don't, don't let them nigga break your heart and keep it. Bitch, please. Bitch, please. You think you're going to break my heart and, and take it with you? Bitch, please. We all been heartbroken, but ain't no nigga kept my heart. It ain't about going through heartbreak. It's how long you're going to be heartbroken. You're already a natural giver. This is what happens when you when you are already a natural giver. If you already a natural giver and then you become rich or you become wealthy or you become extremely successful, you know what happens? You start giving, 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 giving. And you know what happens when you start giving, 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 giving? You start losing, 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 losing. And when you start losing, 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 you're going to start turning to the people that you used to give, give, give. And guess what's going to happen? They can't give you a bitch-ass thing back. You know why? All you are doing is enabling them people. That's all you are doing. Think about it. Motherfuckers that used to ask you for $20. When you start getting money, they're going to start asking you for 20000 And it's either you're going to give it to them or you're going to say, motherfuck, no. What happened to the $20 loans you used to ask for? What happened to the $30? What happened to the $100? Why is you asking me for twenty thousand dollars? Since when you started asking me, you know why I asked you for money like that? Because now you got it. Oh, that ain't nothing to you. You can get that to me. You around here buying this, buying that, buying motherfuckers sitting there counting your motherfucking pockets. Listen, and it, it, and it ain't always about showing your money. Just the fact that you look successful. You done bought your house. You done bought your dream car. 
your business doing good. Everything you sit there and grind it for your motherfucking self, motherfuckers feel like. You know what they hit you with? This is what they hit you with. Let me tell you. They hit you with the, don't forget where you come from. That's what they hit you with. You know what I hit them with? But you gonna suck out my motherfucking ass. Listen, motherfuckers, they hit you with that guilt trip. The only motherfuckers that hit you with that guilt trip is the ones that want you to feel guilty about you succeeding. And that's, now, now that's some motherfucking shit, huh? Motherfuckers want you to feel guilty about you grinding hard. You want better for yourself. You want better for your kids. Motherfuckers want you to feel guilty about you succeeding and you branching off to new things. You don't want to live in the same neighborhood. You don't want you don't want to live in the same city. You want to branch off and see new shit. That's what you want to do. And my motherfucker, first thing they tell you is don't forget where you come from because them motherfuckers still there. That's why. That's why a motherfucker that tell you that keep trying to throw that guilt trip shit in your face and tell you don't forget where you come from, that's because they still there. And they don't got no plans on leaving. And that's not my fault, niece. That's not my fault. It's not my fault that you are comfortable where you at and I wasn't. It's not my fault. It's not my fault I chose to do something different and you chose to do the same shit. It's not my fault. You're not about to guilt trip me and make me feel like I forgot. I ain't fucking forget where I come from. You know why I ain't forget where I come from? Because I don't want to go the fuck back. That's how I know for a fact I didn't forget where the motherfuck I came from. Because I don't want to go back, bitch. You ain't about to sit in and tell me, oh, don't forget where you come from. Bitch, I ain't forget. Because obviously, I ain't going back no time soon. You see where I'm at. I ain't going back. Don't let motherfuckers go tripping you in that shit. And don't be giving it. Don't, it don't matter how big your heart is. You only got to take care of two, two motherfuckers. Two, two different type of motherfuckers. The motherfuckers that birthed you and the motherfuckers you birthed. That's the only people... You are obligated to take care of. That's it. You don't got to pull nobody with you. You don't got to make sure people come with you. You don't got to, you don't got to do no, you don't owe nobody a bitch ass thing. Absolutely nothing. Nobody, all people you got to pull with you to the top is your motherfucking kids. That's it. Now, if a motherfucker want to work to get to the top with you, give them a little helping hand. But if they don't, you don't got time to be dragging no extra luggage with you to the top. How you going to get there? How are you going to get to the top if you keep dragging motherfuckers to the top? They don't want to stay at the top. They just want to go along for the ride. They just want to see who all, who all up here. I just came to see if everybody. I just came to see who all up here. Make sure y'all doing it. Y'all doing all right? All right. Well, I'm just going to sit here. I can sit here and chill. Can I? Okay, I'm, 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 I'm just sit here and chill. And y'all cool with that? Bitch, no. Nobody's cool with your leeching ass sitting up here chilling because you ain't got nothing to sit up here and chill for. Nobody pulled up, nobody pulled us up here. We grinded to get up here. You want to sit your happy ass up here and look around and see who in this bitch? Get your ass back where you was and grind to the top how the fuck we did. Motherfuckers is something, child. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. You ain't got to pull nobody up there with you. Make, make the motherfuckers earn their way up there with you. It's moving on my head. Oh, shit. Hold on, babe. I want you to play a scary game. Man. It's, it moved with your head. <laughs> this shit all right with me, babe. 50%. <laughs> I see it. I like this. When I move, you move. Just like that. <laughs> Fucking with this, bitch. Uh-huh. Let's talk about something. Put your head set on the side. Bitch, I do the fuck I want. You hear me? <laughs>
plus size boutique are blowing me, bitch. If you gonna sell something to me that's plus size, I'm gonna need you to use a real plus size model. Because them hoes y'all be using don't be plus size. Them hoes be big old fine. I don't look like her. I wanna know how I'ma look in it. Until I see a precious looking motherfucker in that outfit, that's when you gonna get my business, baby. Cause y'all obviously forgot what the fuck plus size mean. We fat. You don't gotta try to make us feel good, bitch. We know we fat. Give me models that look like us. Plus size models be small waist, big hips, big legs, and small arms. Bitch, who the fuck is that? What y'all drew that hoe? Cause there ain't no plus size model, bitch. My arms big. Why this shirt got these small ass sleeves on? Shopping at a plus size boutique and I'm looking like what the fuck can I do to lose weight to fit this motherfucking outfit? This shit don't come in my size and you probably thinking I'm mad. Bitch, I'm big mad. I'm plus size mad, bitch. Find me a model that look like me. Stay out my comments trying to push your beliefs on me. Don't come tell me God said don't eat pork. God also said don't put that penis in your mouth before marriage, but you did it anyway. God also said don't bust them legs open before marriage, but you still bust them legs open before marriage. Don't come tell me I can't eat pork. If I won't eat a live pig, I'm going to give me some crackers, some cheese, and some hot sauce, and eat that live pig. You don't follow the Bible word from word. You follow what you won't follow. So don't come tell me what I can't eat. I like pig. And I'm going to eat the pig. I am a pig. I eat myself. Don't come tell me what not to do. Okay? Unless you was following that Bible word from word. And you doing everything he said do. Don't come tell me what I can't do. Okay? Stay out my comments while I eat this pig. If you don't want to see me eat this pig, don't come on my page. Bye, ho. I'm really tired of you niggas thinking we do everything for y'all, bitch. Stop thinking we only get our hair done for y'all. We only get our toes and nails done for y'all. Or we only wear waist trainers on that for y'all. Bitch, we can have nappy hair, corns on our toes with a muffin top, and you still gonna eat our ass, bitch. We don't do it for y'all. We won't look good too, bitch. Just so happen you think it look good too. And without all of it, you still gonna lick the fucking shit out our ass, ho. I'm really... Aww, not ask for his blessings. Yeah. You raised your right, boy.
bitch, bitch. Oh. Oh, 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 Lord, Lord, and Lord. <laughs> Girl, you can't post nothing without somebody telling you how they do it, bitch. I could take a video of me wiping my ass, and somebody gonna be like, oh, no, I wipe my ass in a circular movement, and I wet the tissue a little bit to give it that warm feeling, and I pat for it. Bitch, let me do me, fuck, lord. Girl, you can't. Best time to raise your prices when the fuck you feel like it. That's the best time. When the fuck you feel like it. Bitch, you tripped and fell, and you had to go buy some ace bandages, and they cost you $15. Bitch, let me raise this price. Shit ain't took some money out of my... When the fuck you feel like it? I, I know I'm going to complain, but so, I'm still going to pay. Listen, one thing a bitch going to do is complain, but I'm still going to pay. Listen, I got a problem with MUAs keep raising their price every time the hoes blink, but I'm still going to pay. I'm still going to pay. I got a problem with an MUA raising their price every time they pick up a brush, but I'm still going to pay. I'm still going to pay. I don't understand why these hoes is charging me for every palette they bought. Bitch, but I'm still going to pay. I'm going to pay. I am going to pay. Yes, I'm going to complain. But the thing is, I'm not complaining to them. I'm not complaining like, damn, bitch, you high. I'm not complaining to them because I respect them. I'm, I'm, not going to, I'm not going to complain to the person who's, who's offering me services. I'm not complaining to them. I'm going to go tell my friend. Bitch, bitch you know this hoe charged me. A hundred and eighty dollars to do my makeup, and I went to this whole, this whole crazy. But I'm not complaining to her. I'm not gonna complain to her. Why? I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna come back. I have no reason to complain to her. Yeah, I may. But here you go. I got a right to complain, but it's my money. I could fucking complain if I want too much. I'm paying the price. Why well, can't complain? So yeah, you can raise your fucking price. A bitch gonna play, but a bitch gonna come back. I'm a zombie. You're not a zombie. I'm bored of You what? I'm bored of this. I thought you fucking lied. <laughs> Charlie Baltimore. Now, bitch. Now, come on, my friend. <laughs> That's what you going for. Not Charlie Baltimore, bitch. Black will pop with the red. I know. I'm, I'm with the red. Bitch, I give you fancy brown. brown. But not Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> you know you look like? Don't do me that pregnant. Especially with that hair, bitch. You give me Florida. Oh! Ass. I'm talking about that without the hair, not me. Bitch, like
so bad. <laughs> You got certain kind of friends. See your new friends coming to your house, sit on the sofa and chill. Oh, but not your old friends. The more come to your house loud, loud. Hey, ho! The more go through your refrigerator, eat your baby last bag of chips, tap out with your little boy, go lay in your bed, change the thermostat, take your phone off the charger, put their phone on the charger. See, you got certain kind of friends. Who jump in? The two little boys. You sound tired. Get your ass more. What's up? What's up? What's up? Oh! <laughs> I'm gonna stop for the party. The dress code is red and black. G, you have red to wear black. red and black. Okay, now we don't mind a little white, we don't mind a little gray, but you have to wear red and black. The primary color gotta be red and black. Thank I you. ain't really tripping what y'all wear, but you gotta be red and black. Oh, okay, thank you. Red Super, my man and I are expecting our first child together. He wants to name her after his first BM that passed away. Am I wrong for not wanting that? My child's father is not about to name a child that I carried and pushed out my cat after a woman he was fucking. May she rest in peace. But bitch, you could join her for even asking me some bitch ass shit like that. She going to die. Uh -huh. I really should. I be eating my nigga dick up so much. I, I, I can feel myself getting fat. It's all on my chin. Look. Look. It's all on my chin, Lord. I should really, really, really go on the diet. Too much going on. Hey, guys. So, you know, anytime Super and I link up, it's always about business. So, we heard about the crisis that's going on in Mississippi, and we want to be boots on the ground and help out. So, right now, we've gotten some school buses. We're about to load up with water so that we can actually go to Mississippi and help with this crisis. Yes. Um, so, we heard about the shortage, and uh, we are real big on Love and Die Neighbor. So, we, we need you guys to help us tell us where to bring the waters tomorrow. So, we're going to pack up the, the school bus. We're going to load it up all today. And then tomorrow morning, we're going to ride out to Jackson. So, if you guys could kind of DM us and tell us where to go in Jackson, where we could deliver the water. We don't need um, no cash app. We don't need no money. We don't have no book on me. We literally just need some information so you guys can tell us where to go to bring the water. So if you can help us, please be a be a Thank you. All right, Jackson, we came down here as promised, boots on the ground, Definitely. to make sure that we did our part. Today, we've given over 10,000 bottles of water to the community. Again, we just wanted to make sure that we did our part and hope that we helped y'all through this crisis. Thank you guys for um, telling us the location to go to. We found the perfect location and we made sure we help everybody we can. You ignore people who call it that characteristic of yours that are visible, that may not be the most attractive to everybody. Good thing I ain't trying to attract everybody. Huh? Huh? Good thing a bitch ain't trying to attract everybody because I don't give a fuck if you like my character with stick or not, you know why? Cause bitch, I ain't gotta deal with you. And bitch, you ain't gotta deal with me. So I don't see why you looking for characteristics that you don't like about me anyway. Bitch, you ain't gotta see me. Bitch, you ain't gotta deal with me. Bitch, you ain't gotta ever walk past me. So good thing, my visible characteristic that you don't like, don't motherfucking matter. You stupid bitch. Probably not one for so you gonna free promoter. Good thing go. Wow, wow, wow. This bitch don't like my characteristics. I'm gonna cry when I get off live. 
Because a bitch I don't know. A bitch I can't see. A bitch I can't hear. Don't like me. Time somebody tell me, oh soup, I look up to you. I want to be just like you when I grow up. I always tell them, I want you to be better than me. Like when you, when you, when you idolize people, and when you, it's okay to idolize people, but when you are trying to mimic something they're doing, mm -hmm. you can always be behind them, right? I always tell people like, don't, don't, don't pace yourself. If you're trying to be an entrepreneur, whatever you're trying to try to do, music, whatever you're trying to do, it's truly important to pace yourself. Stop trying to move at the at the speed of social media. I was trying to move at the speed of an influencer who already had a large following, like me. I already had the large following. Stop trying to move at certain paces. Move at your own pace. Like, when you move at your own pace and you really stay focused on whatever you're trying to do, you're going to shine so bright. Trust the process. You're going to feel so much better about yourself. Like, knowing that you did this on your own. That's why I be telling them. Hey, Frank. <laughs> what the baby? I got this? your gift. Let me tell you first. Oh, my Lord. I know, you know the baby shower was coming up, but I wanted to give you my gift You going to be in my baby shower? You gonna be my baby shower? Yeah, I'm gonna be in oh. but I won't give you your gift, your personal gift, right here. <laughs> okay, come on, you could have had this all by the time. I'm sorry. I'm gonna be your personal gift. First. Mm -hmm. oh. Take a good look at that bitch and tell me when the fuck you see me and know that full shit. <laughs> That's the fuck I want you to do. Take oh. a good look at them shoes, bitch. God, you got when the fuck you see me with those on that full shit, ho? Please tell me. And I want you to wear them first, since you were my godson to wear them bitches first. Bitch, you put them on with a nice outfit, Because I couldn't ho. get them. Well, bitch, I got them. You put them bitches on, and you wear them before y'all still wear them, ho. Oh, my God, girl. <laughs> What is your problem? No, you're not getting my phone. It's bedtime. It's bedtime. It's bedtime. I said it's bedtime. And you're going to not talk back to me. You hear me? Name something. You get two X's. That was two. Name something. I don't know what you name. Just go. Name something that could be dangerous if it springs a leak. Five, four, three. I think I know it's gas. One. Oh, no, that's got on there. Plumbing. Five. It's my turn. No. That's ass. You passed your turn. Oh, no, he can't come and I come take the round back. That's why I did that. That was a strategy. I needed to think. And I thought about it, and it's damn. It's who? Damn. Damn you, dumb. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I just knew I had a tooth out. Son, damn, gotta be on it. Do you understand how dangerous the damn is if it's crazy? <laughs> Ma, you ain't gotta do all that though. Damn should be on it. Oh, you damn uh, man, boy. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, I think we're in our line. I'm not lying, man. Let me see. Why well, she hit you that hard and she was lying, bro? <laughs> she hit you hard, bro. <laughs> <laughs> babe, why is damn not on it? It's not, baby. You took all that time strategy yeah. for damn? Yeah, because it make the most sense. Mm -hmm. Yes, it does. You understand what a damn is? I understand. What is a damn? Brands, it is our time. It's our time, baby. Today is Monday. We got to get ready for Black Friday and Cyber Monday. We probably already ready because we don't play about these times if it's your time. It's time for us to go crazy. It's time for us to get ready for all these emails about people not reading the directions. It's that time. It's time for people to be telling us, oh, I forgot something. That's on you, niece. It's our time. We is ready. We is on fire. 
It's time to glow. It's time to be happy. It's time to kick our feet up and get ready to enjoy all this money we about to get. Ha! Like brand. Bitch, you so cool in New Orleans. I'm trying to see if I can give me a quick trip to hell.